Thank you very much. Uh, Tarek Malik with Space.com, and I think my question is for Bruce or for Tom. We see a lot of excited people here in the room that worked on the mission. I'm wondering kind of what comes next. Is there a party? If so, when? <laughs> and does everyone get the night off, or when do they hit Mars time uh, for insight? Thank you. Yeah, so uh, for, for the folks that I just fired a little bit ago, the NAV team and the EDL team, they're, uh, they're welcome to go off and have a celebration. Uh, but the surface operations team, actually their work is just going to get started uh, when we get the Odyssey Pass a little later this evening. Uh, that's when we're going to start planning for the next uh, SOL, the next day. SOL's on Mars, days on Earth. Uh, we'll start planning for that next SOL. And uh, maybe, Elizabeth, you can tell a little bit about uh, what are some of the things we're going to be doing the first couple of SOLs. Yeah, so the first couple of SOLs, we are going to assess the health of the robotic arm. And then tomorrow we uplink checkouts for the actual instruments themselves to check them out and assess their health as well. So in addition to obviously monitoring the lander and making sure those solar arrays have deployed, uh, we want to check out all the instruments that have gone with us to be prepared to put them on the surface and to collect all that science data. Uh, over the rest of the week, we also will open the covers uh, on the cameras and do a d more detailed survey of the workspace in front of the lander where we want to put the instruments so we can choose the best places for them to go.